The following report contains some graphic images. Last night, these women came together to support those who had suffered days earlier. The perpetrators must be caught and brought to justice. Measures should be taken and we should show solidarity amongst each other, men, women, foreigners, against violence. Starting on the square in front of Cologne Cathedral, hundreds then made their way through the city where dozens of women were sexually harassed, assaulted and mugged on New Year's Eve. Jenny had a firecracker put into her jacket, then her phone stolen. Then I heard a sizzling sound in my hood and I somehow tried to get it out of my hood. Then it fell into my jacket and burned everything. The scars will stay. I was lucky that it didn't explode. My mobile phone was gone afterwards. The attackers who also targeted this area outside the main station are described as young men of Arab or North African appearance, which has led to anti-migrant campaigners claiming this is proof Germany is letting in too many refugees. One woman who was there though said they looked like regular pickpockets and leaders are urging people not to come to foregone conclusions but say they're taking swift action. This morning we developed measures which should prevent such incidents in the future. This is very important. It is also important that we don't let it take away from celebrating carnival because of such incidents. Despite there being no suspects or arrests, the event has clearly shocked so many. Police now need to find out who was behind the assaults, described as a new dimension of crime. Frankie McCamley, BBC News.